Hello brothers and sisters. In today's video I'm going to share another one of the more powerful dreams I had in my life that it's been on my heart for a long time to share. First a little bit more about myself. Um, this is kind of a new channel and obviously you're just seeing a fish tank. You're not seeing my face. I haven't really given my name yet <laughs> and uh, I've chosen to do it this way. For a simple fact of, like I said in my last video, I've, I've went through some really rough stuff and uh, I know lots about the dark side and evil that I could expose. But I really, uh, you know, as a believer in the Bible, the Bible says to honor our mother and our father. So this is just my way of maybe being to tell some of my testimony and exposing darkness without shaming my parents or, you know, getting names involved here. In case anybody's wondering why uh, I'm not on here or haven't haven't said my name, that's why. So anyways, this was a very powerful dream. This was a war dream I had, I believe, to be in the tribulation. And I had this dream when I was 16, 17 years old, which is about 25 years ago now. And uh, without saying the actual little town I was from, I basically was in the middle of Essex County, which again is the bottom of Ontario. And my parents' home or where I lived was a county home, you know, like a country road where the houses, you know, are three, four, five hundred yards apart. So I had fields all the way around me. And uh, the dream started off. I was in the front yard and I'm looking out across the road and out into the air. And all of a sudden a big warplane started flying by and I would say about half a half a kilometer away out in the middle going over the middle of the field and as i'm watching all of a sudden i've seen people jumping out like parachuters two 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 one after another about 20 or 30 guys in a row <laughs> jumping out parachuting and i don't know anybody else gets dreams from the lord sometimes he'll show you one thing it's far away and then he can like zoom up for you so all of a sudden i'm 50 feet away and i can see these were little chinese soldiers I could see them coming down on their parachutes, little Chinese soldiers. And it was pretty cool to see. So they're all coming down to the ground, floating down. And I'm watching this. And they're landing in the field and they're running over to the to the highway. And they're, they're kind of going down, hiding in the ditch. And then I turn to the right. And I look over down the, the highway, which is about a quarter mile away from my parents' house. And coming down the highway, all of a sudden I see an army convoy coming with about five or six different trucks and Humvees and whatever other vehicles coming down from the other direction. And the same thing, it was quite a ways away. And all of a sudden the Lord zooms me up as if I'm 100 feet in, right in front of the convoy. And the one truck had about four or five guys standing up in the back of it and they were Russian soldiers. And yeah, I don't know how I knew this. Obviously the Lord's telling me this, but... Yeah, they were Russian soldiers sitting in the back of the convoy, driving down the highway towards from the other direction. And this dream was powerful. I, I knew something wasn't right. It just happened all out of the blue. And I ended up having this dream about three times in the same week. And each time I had the dream, it went a little bit further, a little bit further. And I remember the last time I had the dream, same thing up to there. And I remember uh, me and my dad, my brother, and families in the house, and we're like, what are we going to do? Like, what's what the heck's going on? What are we going to do? And uh, I believe my dad said, well, we're going to have to try to talk to him and see, see what we need to be doing right now. And me and my little brother, he was sitting to the left of me in, I would say, the plant room on the south side of the house, and we're looking over at the highway trying to see these guys. And this is, uh, this is kind of a horrible part, but right as we're watching... Uh, Boom. It was like my, my little brother's head exploded right beside me. Somebody had sniped him. And, uh, yeah, obviously at that point we knew that there, this wasn't going to be anything you could talk your way out of. They were, they were there just to kill. This was some serious war starting. And uh, that's about as far as I remember the dream going. But, like I said, this was a very powerful dream. And I, I had it three times in about a week. So I wanted to get this one out. I know lots of other people have had uh, dreams about China and Russia attacking North America. So this one goes back 25 years I had this. And it was that powerful that I've hung on to it this long. 
so I've been wanting to get this one out and uh, yeah I hope everyone's doing well and hanging on waiting for the Lord we're so close as I always say could happen any day things are crazy uh, I got I got two children in school dealing with that and you know that's stressful for me I'm I'm fighting trying not to go blind I mentioned in my my other video which is very stressful because you know those of us in the Lord know I I'm not touching no vaccination no mark of the beast anything that might even resemble it and you know it's getting really really sticky situation for me because it's getting to the point where I need surgery they don't want to do it for me unless I take these tests possibly take this vaccination so you know it's very stressful to the point that I might have to sit here and go blind for my faith because I would do anything to go to heaven I would make sure nothing nothing can take my salvation away even if I had to sit here and go blind that's how much it means to me and uh, yeah that being said everybody out there stay strong keep looking up we're very close now time is short god bless you all everybody have a good day